all works out right. Well, craft beer, live music, and great food. Sounds like a great way to spend a Saturday. Yeah, joining us with the uh, preview of the Clearwater Craft Beer Fest is Lena, and we have Chef Leo. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. How are you? Good, good. This sounds like another uh, great event that you guys are putting yes. on. Yes, a lot of work, but very exciting. Yeah. I'm so psyched. Um, the Clearwater Downtown Partnership is hosting its third annual um, uh, craft Beer Fest. We really went all out this year. We've okay. partnered with the House of Beer, with the merchants, as well as the City of Clearwater, and we have put out all the stops. We have performances um, all day long. Okay. Like our very yeah. own Chris McCarty. We have. He's in Ella the wings. He's going to perform. Oh, for us I'm very excited bit, I'm to see that. Good tease, Lena. Yeah. Good tease. Yeah, we have Ella Jet, the Rectifiers, Mueza, Dajafari Reggae Band, and a special performance by the Gulfport Gecko um, Marching Band. We haven't forgot the children. We have slime stations and face painting. So it is a family friendly, oh, even though yes. it's a beer event. Where we there have is something be beer for, there. Yeah. Okay. We have something for everyone. We have all our merchants and our restaurants are coming out with their best such as La Fondita. The best, the best here. You brought the goods. Talk about your involvement. Why as a restaurant did you want to be able to participate in this? Which, by the way, is not your first time participating in this festival. Yeah, we've been there three years. We're part of the, the merchants in Cleveland Street. So, I mean, we want to bring down and, and show people what, what, what you got, what, we what got you're got serving. There. Which is what he did here, too. And you're I, showing off some food. I, some of the stuff I've never seen before. I, I mean, it's prepared so uniquely. Tell us about it. This is a can can pork chop. It's a 17 inches uh, pork chop. Uh, it, is it can can pork chop? Can can pork okay. chop is called. So, so it, how it, is it, it made? It, like, what's the has, seasonings? It has the skin on. So when you deep fry it, the skin come, becomes crunchy. So it becomes a rind. So it's deep fried yep. in a way. Huh. And then we have mofongo. Mofongo is a typical Puerto Rican dish uh, that is made out of plantain. It's Ooh. matching this it, pilon. Oh, we deep fry cool. it. We put it in here. We match it here with uh, garlic, bacon, uh, olive oil. This is oil. what we were talking about, by the way. Did yeah. you actually use this to make this one in today? Yes. Nice. Got mm -hmm. a good workout in, I can imagine, right? Yeah. Is it sweet or salty? or what's it's, kind it's, of the... it's salty. It could be done uh, also with sweet plantain. It could be do done with uh, a trifongo, with a uh, cassava plantain and sweet plantain all together. So we have a lot of varieties of the oven. Yeah, okay. I like it. It's a chance to show off your menu if people yeah. haven't visited yes. you before, right? Yes. Well, I got to take the thing that surprises me, though, is when I saw Lena come in and she's talking craft beer yeah normally we always talk about your wine because of poor <laughs> yours so why is it that you decided to to get involved in the uh, in the craft beer scene for this festival well I'm vice chair of the Clearwater partnership downtown partnership and we of course care about downtown we want to promote downtown and you know beer is universal <laughs> and uh, especially craft beer it is yeah. an art form and um, this is not about me or my <laughs> wine bar this is about downtown Clearwater and our partnership is a volunteer um, association we care and we think that beer is a common denominator to bring everyone to downtown mm -hmm. it is this Saturday June 1st from 11 to 11 so it's a full day and we believe that this is a great concept to promote downtown Clearwater and what we have mainly to mainly local craft beer, right? That yes. people are going to be able to find here. Yes, and it's a huge variety. Okay. Which, by the way, did you say this one was, what was this one? So this one is uh, Cool Cucumber. Cool Cucumber. And this one is Mango Jefe. So even the names are so cool, you know? I like it. <laughs> Digging this. Again, cool. Yes. You can enjoy the beer. You can enjoy the food, the music. You yeah. gave us all the activities. Again, we love when you guys Just are some here. some of the activities. I mean, we oh. have dancers, performers, aerialists. I mean... Tip of the iceberg. It is exciting. Really? We really bumped it up a notch this year, if Good not for more. for you. Do you need tickets or anything? Can it is just... free. Free, free, free. Three, like. And it's on the 5 and the 600 block of Cleveland Street, downtown okay. Clearwater. All right. I like that. I say we ended on the free note. That's the most I important know. thing <laughs> to get out. Lena, thank you. Chef, thank you. I we know. appreciate it when we you guys are here. There's the information you see on your screen. Again, the Clearwater Craft Beer Fest in year three. Thanks, guys. I know. And again, we're going to get sampling of the music that's going to be played mm -hmm. as well. So stick with us. Unique.